It is move-in week for new Wildcats attending the Fort Valley State University. But how is the school's enrollment doing? Well, Jessica Chow went to campus to visit and find out about some incoming freshmen who are happy they are young cats. We're looking forward to receiving all of our wonderful new Wildcats. Timothy Hatchett is vice president of student enrollment. He says their number of incoming freshmen have beat expectations. Our goal was 596 based on a three year trend that we did ex with the exception of the, um, the pandemic. And so we're doing well. We're currently at 674, um, which exceeds our enrollment goal. According to the University System of Georgia, Fort Valley brought in its highest number of students in 2011 with almost 4,000 students. In 2020, they topped out at 2,700, losing more than 1,000 students in 10 years. Hatchett says they've used digital platforms to engage with their students more and use marketing to different areas. Um, so with that, we're trending very much toward where we were when with the pandemic, so it's a great thing um, that we're still, still continuing to grow. It matters. My education matters. Tiffany Day moved into the dorms Tuesday. She's majoring in digital media with an emphasis in performing arts. One day I hope to be a director, maybe assistant producer. Like that's, that's my whole scene. Tiffany says she chose Fort Valley University and HBCU because it was important to her identity and education. I went to a predominantly white high school and for me I've always felt like an outcast. I want to feel like I belong somewhere, like a family and Fort Valley just really did that for me. It made me feel like I wasn't just a number. So it was a great decision in my opinion. Betsy Morales is going to major in chemistry. She says she chose Fort Valley because she loved how happy people looked and she wants to make her family proud. I'm the first generation to go to, well, graduate high school, go to college, and I like to inspire my own siblings and to make my parents proud because they did so much for me and I want to do so much more for them. In Fort Valley, Jessica Chaw, 13 WMAZ News. Yeah, Timothy Hatchett says he believes the university will only continue to grow in the coming years.